Lane County nonprofits are ramping up their efforts to find money after a major fundraiser was canceled. Now, yesterday, we told you that the Great Rotary Duck Race has been suspended, maybe forever. And now, as KZI 9 News reporter Michael Severn shows us, groups are rolling up their sleeves and looking for other funding options. I have never known another community fundraiser to specifically support child abuse prevention to the degree that the duck race did. Heather Murphy, the executive director for CASA of Lane County, says she's looking to the future after organizers for the Great Rotary Duck Race announced its suspension. In its 30 years, the duck race has raised more than $7 million for local charities just like CASA. It really moved the needle for families in this community and um, we can't thank them enough. They've been wonderful. That's Lynn Mender, executive director of Parenting Now, another of the many nonprofits that received thousands of dollars from the duck race. For them, the money went to a program that gives parents going through a number of challenges support and help. It is a loss for the agency. Each nonprofit I spoke to tells me just because the duck race is going away for now doesn't mean they are. It just means they'll have to find more funding and work a little harder to serve the community to help keep kids safe. It won't go away. We're not going to let families hang out there with without a support net. While leaders at the nonprofits I spoke to say it could be tough without the duck race, they respect organizers' decision to put it on hold while they look for new leadership. They hope yellow rubber duckies flow down the river in the future. Hopefully something comes around um, in the future for that, but of course, you know, it's leaving a bit of a vacuum that many of us will fill. A vacuum that they hope will not last long. In Eugene, I'm Michael Severin, KEZI 9 News.